Hello everyone, this is, um... This is different. It's that game, Brutal Mario. I think it's Brutal Mario. I don't know, I've never done the hacks before, but I found a, a thing and this should be it. I wouldn't know, actually. I know nothing about Brutal Mario. Someone was just like, hey, well, what you play this? And I'm like, you know what? I could use a change of pace after all those Kako Awards entries. I could just use a, a fun, simple little video game. Let's go and get in and, and, and take the old-fashioned look. I have not played this game in forever. Remember how this is one of my first playthroughs and it got RP'd and then I was very sad about that. Wait, that's the run button? Oh no, though, no. It just takes a little bit for him to get going. Like a real boy. What a nice place. I like how the, the, the green graphics clip into the grass. You could have probably should have fixed that. Okay, so let's take a look at the world map. We got the buttons already visible. That's nice. Wow. This looks remarkably straightforward. This looks really straightforward. Let's 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 be surprised. Oh. Ho ho ho. Great start. I gotta get used to this again. It's been years since I've played this floaty shit. Yeah, there's a Is there an input delay or Is that just me being an idiot? There we go. Yeah, I need to get used to this. I want my shoes, man. Gotta get some of that training in. Ah! There we go. Wow. Man, I love how they're using these Yoshi Island sprites for the environments. Things, man. I used to be top dog. Who those called again? Old Goomba somethings. Get 100 gold stars to get a mini game. Oh no. Eh. Oh man, the nostalgia's real! I used to own an SNES, but it was a, a European one because I live in Europe and not in America, so... I had the cool color buttons! Unlike you chumps! In case you're wondering what my safe state policy is gonna be, it's gonna be I don't want to do this anymore and I just want to get this over with. <laughs> Which means, generally speaking, I'll try to avoid using it as much as possible. But I am here, ultimately, to just have a good time. Well, I guess we beat the game. That went fast. I'm 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 very surprised. I'd like to thank the Academy. Wow, it's just Jesus Christ, this game is sluggish. Maybe it's because I've been watching all those Raukau videos at like double double speed, but okay. Mind if I ask what's going on, video game? Oh. Oh no. <laughs> Whoops. It appears I've crossed into the hell dimension. Well it happens. There's only so much you can truly- Whoa. Now we've crossed into Dimension X. How- how- how peachy. You know, I always wanted to go to Dimension X. And now we're in Midnight Zone. Okay. Mario, could you- could you please adapt yourself to the local, uh, colorations? This looks very similar to the last level. You just beat the game. Game is over now. You can go home. Goodbye. We beat the game. Let's go to the post game. I love the post game. Get over here. Oh, yeah, making this easy, easy. Get. Oh, I think he's rubber banded actually. <laughs> I can't believe I beat the game. I beat it again. How much post game is there? Oh no, it's a level with a secret exit.
I wonder what the secret's gonna be. In case you wonder why I'm also using safe states, I'm using them whenever I don't want to lose lives, because I don't like life systems. They are dumb. I still- I don't know why the hell Nintendo clung to them so strongly, because like, come on- Come on, Nintendo, you're giving enough lives, you're making the game easy enough that the life system doesn't freaking matter anymore, and yet you keep putting it in! It's like, oh, but people love collecting lives! You know, people love collecting things that have value. People don't like having to collect things just because it's like, you oh, gotta- I gotta pick up the one-up mushroom, it's like- sure. The only word you get is a cool one-up mushroom! You get to feel like a real adult now! Oh no, I don't know the name of half these guys. I know that's a Rip Van Fisho. I don't know, those are potty mouse. I bet you they say naughty words on national television! With those big ol' lips. I bet you they say the naughtiest words. Oh. Thank you, Mr. Fish. I don't know what you were doing inside that block, but there you are. Ha! Another flower of fire. But more importantly, we got the switch of pee. If I recall correctly, Yoshi will eventually eat whatever he stuffs in his big old gullet. Because he's a jerk! And he doesn't respect private property! That's mine, Yoshi! That's not your dinner! Now we shall eject it, push it, and climb our way to the top. Man! I appreciate this difficulty curve giving me just a little bit of time to get used to things. You know, another game I want to play is, is Super Mario Omega. I heard it's, it's a classic. Oh, God, no. Don't tell me this is what I think it is. Tell me this is just a bonus room. Is there anything up there? Doesn't look like it. Goodbye. I got a bonus room. How charming. I got all the five dragon coins. Aren't I just a hero? No! Well, it's my bad. Goodbye, Yoshi! See you later! I beat the level! Awesome! Cool! Invincible barrier. How about we get the secret lo the, 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 the secret here? I happen to know of an ancient Chinese trick. That goes something like this. You step on a switch, then you eat it! I actually don't know how to do this. But I'll look it up. Aha! I see. Aha! Hmm. I can- I can do this. Not like that, though. Can you even do this glitch underwater? Ah. Oh. Giving it some additional thought, I remembered a detail about Mario that just happened to catch my eye. This thing doesn't go down all the way. And fun fact, there's two conditions under which you can pass past the goal gate. One is you're off-screen at the time that you pass it. The other one is that you can walk under it at any given point. There's several, like, some people make, like, fun hack levels where they, they, they do it. Like, okay, you gotta, gotta, gotta avoid getting the goal. Oh no. What a sad bag. Those guys are super annoying underwater, though. They just go up slowly. Oh no, it's Torpedo Ted. Literally the last guy I wanted to see. That does make me cautious, though. Oh, and now it's Bully Bills! Don't tell me there's a... God damn it. Great. Excellent. Fantastic. You just go up over there. There's the exit. Well, that took a little bit of work, but I guess that mentally preps me for what's awaiting in the future. Woo! Bow! I love how it gives a little peace sign. A little, little, little V for victory. We have unlocked a secret exit, which goes to a place known only as the Warp Star. Goodbye, Mario.
Why, hello there. My goodness! Wait, I don't get to... Hmm. Next time, we're gonna see if we're gonna do an invincible barrier. Is that really an invincible barrier? Is it really just at some point the game's like, no? Hmm. Why do I have Leaf Man? Leaf Shield. Since when is this Mega Man? Maybe we'll learn next time. Why this is Mega Man all of a sudden?